When Blake Lively expressed her honest feelings about playing her Gossip Girl character, she said, it always felt a little personally compromising. In a 2015 edition of Allure magazine, Blake Lively, the actress most known for playing Serena Vander Woodson in the renowned teen drama series Gossip Girl, discussed her internal struggle with the importance of her character as a role model. The position of Blake Lively regarding the role of Serena Vander Woodson in Gossip Girl. People loved it, Lively acknowledged, but it was the personal compromises that troubled her. The actress claimed, as per the Allure magazine, she mentioned, but it always felt a little personally compromising. You want to be putting a better message out there. She wanted to use her platform as an actress to spread messages that shared her goals and views. Blake Lively frequently struggled with choosing between her obligations as a professional and her desire to set a better example because of Serena's character, who was notorious for her complicated web of relationships and sporadic irresponsible behavior. According to rumors, Serena's on-screen presence often made it difficult for Serena's fans to tell her from herself. The lines blur, Lively said in reference to that. When everyone on the show is dating the same person off-screen and you're asking the costume designer, hey, can I take that home? That doesn't help. When someone thinks they know you extremely well but actually doesn't, it is strange. The possible effect of Serena's actions on impressionable fans was one of the most important worries Blake stated. The character's actions, which included drug usage, relationships, and conflicts, aroused concerns about how responsibly depicting such a figure in the entertainment industry should be done. It's strange when people think they know you quite well but actually don't, Lively commented. In the 2015 issue of Allure magazine, Lively also expressed her concerns, stating, I would not be proud to be the person who gave someone the cocaine that made them overdose, then shot someone, and slept with someone else's boyfriend.